Merry Days is a modern musical about four New Yorkers who are all trying to figure out how to live their lives in the big city. And through their stories, it looks at how um, you make connections in such a big, anonymous place. And also how your actions can have a huge impact sometimes on people you've never even met. The, the piece is in the Rosemary Branch Theatre, which is obviously a very small, um, intimate space. I've done lots of American musicals in the past. It's one of my favourite scores. It's very interesting to play. It's got a good mix of songs between kind of some quite nostalgic ballads, um, which they have been performed beautifully, but also some very loud, raucous, rock and rolly kind of style music. And then when all the chords appear at the same time, which really kind of stand out. Maybe. says don't worry everything will be okay the decision to put Ordinary Days on now came from uh, Natalia and I. We've worked together on a few things in the past and now that we're both living in London decided we wanted to explore the ideas of living in a large city and felt that Ordinary Days was the perfect musical to do that with. Okay, here's my frustration. The city tends to make me feel invisible. Yes, of all the superpowers, it's the one I'd like to have, but it isn't very handy when you're trying to get noticed as a pioneer of visual art. In the show, we have four very different characters, um, but all of whom are struggling with the choices they've made in their lives. And with the question of how much of your life is chosen and planned by you, and how much is just down to chance. We're putting it on in a really unique venue. It's really small, so you get a really intimate performance where you feel you can really connect. This is a small, small French venue, um, which is beautifully decorated, but it really adds to the kind of intimacy of the piece because the singers, especially when the piano and singers are playing very quietly together, it again brings everyone's focus right to the story that's happening. It started with the wine. The wine. The wine. We were shopping for a bottle to bring to her cousin's soiree. My cousin's a sous chef, she's very warm I think the show is surprisingly funny. Um, it's bittersweet and heartfelt, and it's thought-provoking. Um, I think it deals with some really interesting ideas, but in a very fun and relatable way. In my head we hug, and our friendship sets sail like an almost, not quite, New York sort of fairy tale. Don't touch me. If you'd like to find out more about our production, you can visit our website, which is atomicus.co.uk. By one, by one, by one, this whole entire city's gonna love.